October 29, 2020, the Japan Coast Guard demonstrated the General Atomics MQ-9B Sea Guardian capabilities to local media. It is an unarmed aerial vehicle specialized in maritime surveillance. The event took place at the Japan Maritime Self-Defense Forces Hachinohe Air Base in Omori Prefecture in northern Japan. Naval News Japan contributor Yoshihiro Inaba was on site. The UAV can fly at an altitude of 40,000 feet and for up to 30 hours. On station time is about 25 hours. The aircraft is equipped with the Lynx multi-mode radar, Raytheon's Sea View radar, as well as an EOIR sensor to monitor vast areas of the ocean in all weather conditions. The JCG's decision to consider the introduction of UAVs was prompted by the Japanese government's decision in December 2016 to adopt a new policy for maritime security. The policy is designed to strengthen the functioning of the JCG in response to the recent activity of Chinese fishing and government vessels in the waters around Japan. Therefore, it was decided to consider the introduction of UAVs for the purpose of continuous monitoring of these foreign vessels, especially those operating within Japan's vast exclusive economic zone. In fact, Japan's territorial waters, plus its EEZ, are the sixth largest in the world, and it would be difficult to keep watch on such a vast area with manned aircraft and patrol vessels alone. Data from these tests will also be shared with the JMSDF, which is also considering the introduction of UAVs to account for the impact of future population decline. For Navy missions, the Sea Guardian can be fitted with an electronic intelligence payload as well as sono buoys dispensers for anti-submarine warfare. This month alone, the United States State Department approved possible foreign military sales of MQ-9Bs with anti-submarine warfare mission kits to the United Arab Emirates and Taiwan.